And so the first blush of spring spread across the land, melting the snow surrounding your cottage. After spending the winter in Silka's delightful company, you agree that you share a desire to reunite with Queen Kaver high in the mountains. Deciding to leave the world of humans behind, you've sold your cottage and most of your possessions, and with the sweet moth girl at your side, you set out for the mountains to enter the crystal caverns once again. <sighs> hmm. Scooch over, human. I want to sit beside you. I know it's finally spring, but this forest still feels so cold. <laughs> Especially at night. I'm going to snuggle up with you, if that's okay. <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> Do you mind if I ask you something? <laughs> I know I don't need to ask permission, but I like being polite, and it may or may not be a kind of personal question. Fine, fine. <laughs> I'll try to speak more freely from now on. So, my question for you is... Do you have any regrets? It wasn't easy to give away so much that was once precious to you. We monsters don't typically surround ourselves with so many material goods. Unless you're a dragon, of course. <laughs> oh. But still, is there anything you miss? Yeah, I could tell that giving away most of your books was hard for you. But you kept your favourites, so that's good. Why do I ask? Well... I guess I just wanted to check in on how you were feeling. We'll be at the mountainside tomorrow, and it feels kind of like the point of no return for you. Of course, no one can say for certain what the future holds, but I just wanted to ask if you're okay. No, you're welcome. <laughs> Now, let's do a last check of everything we've brought. Mm -hmm. We'll pack away the tents tomorrow. And we've got the berries and honey, water, books, potions, snacks, rope, more rope, <laughs> pittons, torches, the mistress's silk that she gave you. Oh, and your gift. Don't you worry. I'm sure Kava will love it. And I think it's the perfect gift to show your devotion to her and that you're determined to stay in our world. Mm. <laughs> now, come along, human. We have a long day ahead. So let's get some rest. After a few more cuddles, of course. <laughs> well, <sighs> here we are. No turning back now, human. Uh, so what are you waiting for? Lead on. Um, what do you mean you don't remember the way? Mm hmm Oh. Kaver carried you to the entrance on her back. Oh, let me guess. She was very fast, climbed on a lot of walls, scaled cliffs effortlessly, and turned your head inside out with dizziness. Oh, well... Yeah, that sounds like her. And it's been years since I've been back to the mountains, so I certainly don't remember the path to the crystal caverns. Hmm. 
Let's just start walking through the entrance, and speak up if you spot something familiar, alright? Wait, what's that? Do you smell that, human? No? Oh! My, my antenna is twitching. I, yes, it, it's because I can smell something. It's faint, but very distinct. Describe it? Okay, um... It's, it's a musty sort of smell. With... A spiciness to it? Kind of smoky, too. But in a herbal sort of way, not like a fire sort of way. Mushrooms and fire moss. Yes, that must be it. Um, but how do you know that scent? Lady Azir brought them to you in Kava. Oh, wait, you've met Lady Azir? What's she like? Kava spoke about the other Dryder leaders when I was with her, but I never got the chance to meet any of them. <laughs> Passionate. Well, I've certainly heard that's one way to describe her. <laughs> Is she as beautiful and strong as the rumors say? Oh, she sounds wonderful. And she likes you. Or is at least familiar with you. Hmm. Normally, I would heed the warnings of the elders and not strain to the unfamiliar darkness, but we monsters have incredibly strong senses of intuition. Rather than wandering in these dark tunnels and getting lost, why don't we follow my antenna and head for the glistening grottos? It's not too far from Kava's kingdom, and then we can ask Lady Yazir for assistance. Alright, let's go! Um, is it alright if I hold your hand? I, I mean, I can see in the dark, but I just want to make sure that you don't get lost. Or, or, or scared. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, the scent is getting stronger. I do really miss the mushroom tea that the dryers make. It's a savoury tea, so it's not for everyone, but I like it. Human, did you, did you hear that? Get down, here, behind this rock. Keep holding my hand, and on my signal, run, okay? Good. Now, stay calm, and don't move. getting stronger. I think we're almost there. Where did this cliff come from? Okay, um, put your arms around me and I'll try to fly us down. Hold on. Were you always this heavy? I'm, I'm not being mean, I just... Right, human? Oh, th 
That's a relief. I'm... I'm not doing so good. The world won't stop spinning and... Oh... What, why is my back bleeding? <laughs> oh, but, but we're so close. We're... Well, well, well. Look who stumbled into my web.